Hello everybody, Ben Pope here. Welcome back to the Romania campaign in Napoleon Total War. Welcome back indeed. It's gonna be a fantastic episode. Why? Well, because, well, it's not winter anymore. So that means I can move into Russia. I already uh, moved two armies up here to go for maybe one or two territories up there. If we can, there's also a, a force gathering and for defense of this area. Uh, so that's going to be fine in case something comes from Kiev. And uh, if you haven't seen last episode, uh, we had to deal with a bunch of snow and we couldn't do a whole lot. But we did have a couple of uh, outer resolve fights up here um, because we were up against smaller forces. But now we have a army of Prussians, which we took the general out with our spy. So that's going to help. We have to fight those guys. And we have to fight that army so it doesn't do any harm to our territory. We have those two forces that are going to come down and attack that dude. And then um, this guy should be able to finish this guy off. So let's start with that. Uh, look, it says it's going to be an easy fight because they don't have a general. And... Uh, yeah, I don't know if I want it. If I want a chance. Well, let's do it. I did other resolves last time anyway. So we oh we lost like half our people. Well not half, but five hundred people is a lot to lose. And they're still here. See, that's why I don't like other resolves. Bloody hell. Go and rest. Go in oh it's not good. Alright. Uh he's coming up to help as well, so you're gonna be over here next time. Just in case uh, you are, which one of you is more in good shape? You're in worse shape. Okay, so you're going to come down here. And then you're going to come over here as well. Which will allow you to move closer. And then you can attack. Okay, and this one we're not going to auto-resolve because I don't want to lose 50,000 people, even though I don't have that much. Uh, but uh, we're definitely outnumbering them, and uh, yeah, we just have to silence their cannons, and the rest isn't such a big deal. So we have cannons of our own, we have some cav. Let's get to work. This button. While this loads, I want to say thanks for tuning in. It's awesome to see you guys here. And I hope you enjoy the video. Uh, be sure to check all my other content out and share it out content with your friends if you think they would enjoy it too. It will help my channel grow. Alright. So our reinforcing army should be coming from behind us. Though this game doesn't tell you where it's coming from. But that's that was the placement on the map when we uh, when we set up Meaning when we actually, before we entered the combat, that's where the army was, was behind us, right? Okay, you sir will have to kind of hide for a bit. Although there's not much of a hiding spot, uh, maybe in the trees. Okay, so... Oh, I didn't make these guys into a group. Alright, then we have these three. Which shall be over here. As a group, and then we have two grenadiers. Well, we're going to put them on this side. Grenadier. All right. Then we have cannons. Cannons can sit on this hill, preferably stretched all the way out, unlimbered, ready to fire. Go closer, even. We we'll go to about here, like this. All right. And then we have what's left. Three engineer brigades, which is our longest range units we have in this army. And we have a heavy cav. And then we have two of these mounted Haiduch. They will have muskets, which they shoot from uh, horseback. So that's useful. Okay. Um, 
I think that's it. I think I think we got it. I think we're yeah. We'll make this this guy a number so we don't lose him, uh, and the rest we might lose a little bit, but that's okay. All right, let's head forward. Uh, cannons are incoming, but my uh, reinforcements won't come in until we lose people. I forgot about that. See, I'm thinking I'm still playing Warhammer or Rome 2 or something that where you have units uh, reinforce you even if you're not needing them. Okay, who am I gonna attack? Uh, possibly there and the 12 pounder is gonna try to snipe out the general. Alright, everybody run to your location, please. And we need to help on this side with the grenadiers. Uh, we need to move forward. All right, uh, heavy cav. I don't know what we're gonna hunt down, but we're gonna hunt down something. There's a lot of horses around the cannons there. Run! Alright, so these guys are not attempting to push against me. They're setting up to protect the cannons, so we're gonna have to move in. Okay, guys. Tricky, tricky, sticky situation here. A little bit, you know, not so bad. Because they're not really pushing forward. They're just like, hey, we're gonna sit tight. And then, if they're gonna sit tight, I have to move. And, um... Looks like this is gonna happen. Guys need to stop there. Did I get the button off? I think I did. But I don't know. being bombarded heavily now. It's okay, you guys pushed on the left. I'll push the left too. Oh, jeez. Alert. We have to take those guys out, even though we might lose some of our... Um, It is chaos -y. We like chaos, right? Are you still firing your stuff? That's alright. Wow. We just lost people off the horse like there's no tomorrow. <laughs> Silence the guns! Oh, this is good. This is good. We're, we're doing fine there. Just gotta keep pushing. Uh, you guys on skirmish? No. Alright. Well, this is not looking so good. I have to admit. Especially since these guys are left behind and not fighting. Move! Square! Go this way. Where's these guys? Who? Uh, did we lose the... We lost those horses. Alright, so... We're getting somebody new. I wonder who it is. Let's find out. Well, that's not telling me. Oh, the general. 
Bloody hell, that's not helping me at all. Can't really use the general. Alright, you guys need to uh, unlimber so you can move forward. Okay, uh, created a bit of chaos there with that charge up in the center, I think. And uh, we're gonna just push. Uh, we're gonna push against these guys. Uh, we need to go over there. Okay. Uh, shoot there, please. Uh, you move. You move later. Covering fire. Are you able to shoot there? All right. Um. Again. Again. I think I got him into square. I don't know. Move up. Hey, you need to move out here. Come on, take all these guys. Oh, serious? I do have no ammo. Infantry! Okay. Uh, I don't know what else to tell you besides we need to keep moving. We need to keep moving. We lost We lost one unit of cav. Uh, that's probably not so bad. But everyone else needs to keep moving. Move faster! Okay, you guys are fine. Uh, we're gonna continue for just a little bit. Uh, need to take out some of these guys. Uh, General. Since you're never gonna get here, but anyway. I, I even stopped moving my... I was gonna move my cannons. Remember? And that never happened because I forgot about them. How the heck are still. Uh, why are you. What are you doing? Run! Why are they still firing? This fight is over. I'm so confused. Did I actually see that the fight was over and now they're saying that, you know, it's not over? Going there. Right. Uh, you can stop firing too, there's no use. I'm gonna chase down some of these cannons, I think. General was like, "Yeah, I got to do something! Yay!" One of our units has used all its ammunition, sir. Yes, well, they were not even supposed to be. Oh, they're all dead. Okay. You're supposed to be in melee mode, not in in uh, you know, whatever shoot mode. Run! Run for your lives! Not that you have more than one life, but you know. People fly in this? 
I thought somebody got hit and flew. It's possible. You guys are really slow at killing guys. Alright. Right, let's speed this up a little bit. We're um we're not gonna get any any fancier. Kinda finish these guys off so they don't run away again. Alright. Super leveled up high douche. Probably like it. Look at that. How many chevrons are those? At least four. Run faster. Okay. I think we're good. Close victory, he says. I'm not sure how that's possible. I clearly had I clearly still had all my units. Except for one. I lost one totally. Like I lost five hundred people. And it's a close victory. Come on. How are you still alive? So bad. Ugh. Go. Oh. Trade gained. Courageous leader. Uh, mentioned in dispatches. Morale in battles. And. Yep. Anyway. Well, that was good. Uh, could have gone even better, but that was good. I mean, you know, I I resolved one of those fights. Um, we're gonna have to come back slightly and recoup, but by that time, this guy will be in f for full force there. So I'm I'm good. Is he? Well, he's not. He's he's got lots of range, which is good. But then I have to watch for any sort of heavy incoming. Uh, this is repairing. I think. I think I might end the turn. Let's see where armies are in Russia. If I can attack anything here. Oh, uh, there's plenty of forces there, and we're gonna go down. You know, I thought I thought yeah. I wanted to see what's at Minsk. Okay, so that might be an option next turn for some combat. And I forget about that one gentleman from the Russians that are sort of in my area. Uh, you're at war with France. I don't know if allying with you will be such a good thing. I don't think I could be... I don't understand what they are. I don't think I could be allies with, with someone that's got an enemy that's my ally. So I don't, I mean, if I cancel this, I can request alliance. Well. Uh, how about some technology? Do you want some technology? I don't know. I mean, I don't really need a, a war I mean, I, uh, down there, but I also don't need any more friends. We're gonna, we're gonna not say anything to that. You have to fight your war against friends on your own. Sorry. Although I rather own Fran uh, own Italy than France, so that's something to consider. All right, what's Prussia gonna do now? They're bringing in some forces around there, but that's not gonna do him any good. Yeah, do do leave Vilnius from Li Lithuania. Leave, you know, I can take it over myself. Uh, if you're not there, I can do that easier. Look, Russian spy, go away. Or not. No, you're not even a spy, you're a gentleman. I'll take someone to get you. Oh! That's why, that's why those guys wanted... Alliance. The heck. What? Why would... Why would France do that? Uh, okay, so uh, let's go back and see if we can fix it. If not, we are probably in trouble. Who's this? Savoy. France. 
You're friendly. Why do you not want alliance? I, I, we have military access, but no alliance. I mean, yeah, I don't understand. I don't know what happened. They're apparently not, apparently we're back to normal. It was a misunderstanding. Misunderstanding on their part. I do have to take out Naples, I believe. Uh, for my victory conditions. And Greece, I, d I never, I never understood that. But apparently, I'm gonna have to eventually uh, attack my closest friends. Although we didn't really do anything to help each other, we just kind of, we just kind of, you know, existed together. Um, right. Okay. So, what is it? Pass passports. I guess I could do passports. Uh, what's this? National propaganda. Uh, 20 turns there, there. Why don't we... Why don't we not do those yet? Why don't we do something else? Um, so here we'll go for something that is quicker. Uh, we have to build Army Staff College. Um, so that's going... Steamship production, steam locomotive, I guess you'll do that. And then we have to build the Army Staff College. Which is... Being built, okay. Uh, yeah. You guys can head over up here. I think there's more... Yeah, there's more recruiting. More recruiting happening. What can we construct? Uh, I think we'll go for. Well, we're gonna. I think we're gonna save our money. Uh, build up infrastructure out here. I think just in case we need it. Prague. All is built. Okay, uh, so we have to bring our butts across the border. Uh, you're gonna go over here. And you're gonna go over here. Apparently that's not good enough. Why isn't it like green? Like that one. Okay, now it is. Right, uh, you can sit in the town. That's pretty much a full force there. And then you... Yeah, might as well. Might as well come in. We will hit them hard. And um, also we'll hit these guys pretty hard. Where can we go? We can go at the bridge. And you can go in that town. Steam powered factory. I don't really want to destroy it. I'm pretty impressed that they have a steam powered factory. Do you? Do I even have? I don't have a steam powered factory because I guess I'm making one now. Two. Uh, definitely have to build that. How come I forgot about that? Spy. Come get this guy. Alright, you are moving. Okay. I, I, I have to like double check and triple check my, my protocol checks. Uh, you can almost go and take out that town if it didn't have the, the small star, star fort. If it didn't have the star fort, you could do it. You'd be like, yep. Alright, so what is... Oh, there's like nothing here. Okay. We're going to make our move, guys. We're going to make our move. Uh, we're going to have to... I think we're going to have to just sit at the bridge, really. Um, that's not going to reinforce. Uh, I really don't want to damage their factory. I, I actually I do. I want to damage their factory. Okay. And we'll, we'll come in here. 
Right. Be wary, my friends. My Russian friends. Uh, should I... Should I upgrade? I mean, we're taxing them so bad. I mean, look at this. 42% tax. And this is gonna go to 60% tax. That's... That's as... As... Bad as it can get. Like, really. And that's kind of what the world is doing nowadays, isn't it? We pay so many taxes. Even if it doesn't look like you're paying 60% tax in all the countries, you still are somehow. It, it depends on how much money you're making. You're, like, most of it. Most of it feels like it's going somewhere you don't want to. Okay, I think we have to end the turn. Uh, unless we have something to do in the government. I don't think we have any. We have some ministers, and I could use a better navy minister. So, let's see. You're 39, you're 46, you're 35... Uh, army administration. Hmm. Um, okay, so that's that guy. Morally impaired. So you're the first one to go. You're going to go in here, just replace that dude. And then I think you're going to be going. If you don't get any upgrades, as your harsh reputation, then you have to go. Um, and then you, fortunately... You got something. Morally impaired. Okay, well, that's not going to be good. Uh, somebody got brave soldier. Alright, so you... Oh! <laughs> uh, you got management, Bon Vivian. So that helped. That helped. That, you know, that was worth it. Okay. And apparently you'll be even better at army stage. I don't know if I should do that. Let's see. There we go, that, that makes it 4 star for the navy and 5 star for the army. Good deal sir, good good freaking deal. So I have better recruitment and technology rate and upkeep. Awesome. Okay, well that was, that was useful. Let's end the turn. I still have more money to spend. It's quite nice. Although I don't want to spend too much money. Sara Moldova want alliance and they want what oh I don't know guys I mean they don't have any wars they're allies with Spain and France already let's do it let's let's do it although I'm giving them technology uh, they probably should have abolished s slavery by now uh, if you didn't know Sara Moldova was supposed to be next to Romania but the game placed it like in Spain it's pretty much where Barcelona sh uh, is so, uh, let's just accept that. I gave him some of my technologies and they gave me 6,800 coins. And we're allies. Not sure how that's going to help. But we are the new force in the East and Europe altogether, really. Uh, I'll say we we're dividing Europe between ourselves and friends at this moment. Although it's more like I'm taking a lot of Europe and France is just sitting where it is. is it, does that does that sound bad? I don't know. Okay. Building sabotage. Who the heck did that? I'm looking for you. I'm looking for you. I can't see you, but you're there. General is available. Uh, unit recruited in Austria. Uh, construction and sabotage. All right, so let's upgrade stuff. I know that that spy was going after that dude, but I think I think we can get him with somebody else. Uh, there's a neutral gentleman there. Let's see. We have a spy over in... Oh, hello. Go in. Go on in then. I think they're all mine now because 
the Austrians that were there are no longer Austrian, so they kind of left, I guess. Uh, sounds terrible. They ceased to exist. Uh, yeah, let's let's do industrial gold mine. I don't think it's a problem. We're okay with public order. Uh, where was that spy? Here it here it goes. Spy. We have, a, we have a fancy gentleman that's coming your way. We have a decent chance of getting him. He might stop here, but we'll get him anyway. Okay. Uh, you should probably go close to Berlin. We want to see what's going on. All right. Uh, we're not. We're not fully up to speed yet. But this guy is. And this guy is going to go up here. Block the ways of the intruders. Because they seem to want to go around through here instead of up there. And, uh... Heck, I don't know. I don't know. I think I want... Yeah. He needs more cannons. Let's go. Alright. Uh, so he'll be ready next time. And you guys can pretty much attack Vilnius. And there's no construction. There's no... Uh, you know, that thing. Fort. There's no fort. So we're going to attack him as soon as we can. Let's see if we can get... And get a general spent with the spy. Uh, it's kind of tough, kind of hard. I, it's kind of at risk. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Just, just when you think you might do something cool, that happens. Like you know, you just have a feeling. You just have a feeling. You have to stick around because there's a there's a enemy spy there that that destroyed my building, sabotaged my building. I don't know what good that does for them. It just made me mad, really. Uh, we're gonna need reinforcements in this area because of how things are gonna go up in Russia. We uh, will have to exchange wounded uh, for fresh troops. So. Let's get, yeah, let's get four of those there. Uh, you can't recruit anything, but we'll upgrade this anyway, because we have money. And um, those guys will make it. Up. Okay. What else can I do? I'm almost out of time again. I don't really want to make the episodes longer than half hour, because it seems like less people tune in if it's too long of an episode. If you've experienced that yourself, you look. I know. I know. If I have some time to watch something and it's like an hour long, I don't click on it because I say I don't have an hour at the moment. So, uh, but next time we will definitely push in with more of these armies. I think I need to bring him in here. Will that make you? How about in here? Oh, that's not gonna work. Doesn't seem like it's helping with with uh, the replenishing. Some some other games does, but this one seems like it's not. Okay, so we'll go here to be uh, guarding that, and you won't make it in one turn, but that's fine. And these guys should probably join as well. We're just nourishing that area with military. Uh, I think I'm okay with you guys staying here just in case I need some kind of protection in this area. I think I'm okay with that. Alright, you guys. Thank you again for tuning in. It's been real fun. It's been awesome. It's a great episode again. And I hope you liked it. Please do comment down below with any thoughts, suggestions, or whatever you might want to say. 
Don't forget to hit the like button and share this out with your friends. Subscribe if you're not a subscriber, subscriber yet. I hope to see you guys in the next one where we will take our forces deeper into Prussia and Russia. Have a good day. Bye-bye.